So this question says a proposal for a new library was included on an election ballot. A radio show stated that three times as many people voted in favor of the proposal as people who voted against it. So I'm going to just do a little bit of translation here on that sentence. I like to translate anytime I have a longer question like this, especially when I see some quantitative information provided like we have there. So what do we know? Um, people who voted against it, so I'm going to say against. We don't know how many there were, so I'm going to call that X. People who voted for, that sentence that we just read from the question, basically said is three times as many, so I'm going to call that 3X. So there's my translation thus far. The next sentence says, a social media post reported that 15,000 more people voted in favor of the proposal than voted against it. All right, so 4 was equal to... X plus 15,000. So we have two kind of representations for the number of votes for the proposal. It's three times X, but it's also 15,000 more than X. The next sentence says, based on these data, how many people voted against the proposal? All right, so I could just use a plug-in answers scenario here where I can say, let's see, is it could it be true that 7,500 people voted against well, if 7,500 people voted against, then based upon this first criteria, we'd have three times that number or 22,500 people who voted for it. And then based upon this scenario, we'd also have, if X again, this is saying we're basing this on choice A. So if X were 7,500, then 3X would be 22,500 and X plus 15,000 or 7,500 plus 15,000 would also equal uh, 22,500. So I like it, right? How, why do I like it? It's because it fits both criteria, both 3x and x plus 15,000, give me the exact same number based upon the 7,500. So I think that choice A is correct. Now I'll show, I'll go through the process for choice B just to show you why choice B would not work. So if x were equal to 15,000, then our 3x would equal 45,000, okay? But now let's see, does it match that 15,000 plus 15,000, right down in this category here, x plus 15,000. Now that does not equal 45,000, that equals 30,000. So given the two criteria that we know must be true for the, f the votes for the proposal, we're getting two separate values, right? We're getting 45,000 and we're getting technically 30,000 in the second criteria. So that's why 15,000 or choice B would not work. And that's why the rest of these also would not work. So choice A is correct.